please do subscribe my channel and don't forget to click on the bell icon to get notifications of my new videos hi this is Rakesh structural engineer today I am going to show you a building plan of a site having the dimensions of 40 feet by 50 feet and this site has east facing and here is the site and here is the plan also yeah from here this is the east side and this is the north side and this is the west side and this is the south side and we given the setback of 7 feet 6 inches in the east side and 9 feet 1 inches in the north side and 3 feet 3 inches in the west side again setbacks and we given the bore point at this point that is northeast corner and we given the place for the sump or this place and coming to the main structure here it is and this is the step one and this is the step, step two after two steps we will enter to the veranda the veranda dimensions are 6 feet 8 inches in the horizontal and 3 feet 9 inches in the vertical direction and from this veranda we will enter to the drawing room this drawing room for the outer peoples and this drawing room dimensions are 10 feet 9 inches in the horizontal and 12 feet 4 inches in the vertical direction and this place is this rectangular portion is for cupboards in this cupboard they will provide some books or some other materials and we have the main door entrance door in the east direction at this point and this is the glass frames at the both the sides of the main door from the main door we will enter into the lobby and from this drawing room we have the openings to the number one to the lobby and number two to the veranda okay in the left side of the lobby that means in the southeast corner we provided the open kitchen with the dimensions of 10 feet 6 inches in the horizontal and 8 feet 3 inches in the vertical direction and we provided this to at the corner of the southeast that means at this point and in this kitchen we installed one utility room with the dimensions of 6 feet 8 inches in the horizontal and 3 feet 9 inches in the vertical direction and from this lobby we will enter into the hall the hall has the dimensions of 7 feet 11 inches in the vertical direction and 12 feet in the so 17 feet 11 inches in the horizontal direction and 11 feet in the vertical direction and this hall we provided TV in this area and from this hall we have access to the bedrooms number one this is the master bedroom at the left side and the normal bedroom in the right side that means master bedroom in the southwest corner with the dimensions of 12 feet in the horizontal and 12 feet 9 inches in the vertical direction from this master bedroom we have access to the water closet with the dimensions of 6 feet in the horizontal and 9 feet in the vertical direction and this is the water bathtub and this is the TV providing area for the master bedroom and this is the another bedroom with the dimensions of 10 feet 9 inches in the vertical and 12 feet 9 inches in the sorry, 
10 feet 9 inches in the horizontal and 12 feet 9 inches in the vertical direction and we have dining area at this point that means right side of the hall at this point and we have the another water closet with the dimensions of 5 feet 5 inches in the horizontal and 5 feet 8 inches in the vertical direction and we have staircase in the north direction in the center of the hall that means at this point these are the two flights and this portion is landing <coughs> area and we will enter to the first floor or terrace from in this way that means from in this direction we will enter to the terrace and we have passage of three feet wide under the staircase from this passage we have one opening to the north facing in this north facing we given the setback of nine feet one inches in this setback area that means in the northing area we provided the gardening and for some area for the car parking area at this point and if you see the elevation of this staircase it will looks like this look like this it will start as starts from here and this is the landing this is the flight one and this is the flight two the people go to the terrace from in this direction they will come over here and this is the landing from this point we will they will go to the terrace under this landing we provided this portion is door here it is this is the door we provided the under the landing and this is the wash basin after completing the lunch dinner supper and uh, breakfast they will wash their hands at this point without going into the any water closets they will wash their hands at this point in this wash basin which is provided under the landing beside of the opening in the north direction and coming to the doors we provided total number of doors is this is the number one and this is the number two and this is the number three and this is the number four and this is the number five and this is the number six and this is the number seven and this is the main door the number eight total we provided the main eight doors in this this is the main door in the east direction and coming to the windows this is the window one and this is the window two these two windows in the master bedroom and this is the window three in the another bedroom and this is the window four and this is the window five in the hall and this is the window six seven in the drawing room and this is the window eight in the kitchen and this is the window nine in the utility and you are seeing that these red dotted lines are beams which are connected to the columns these are the columns there are total 12 number of columns this is the number one number two number three number four number five number six and number seven number eight number nine number ten number eleven and number twelve 
these are the total 12 columns and these dotted lines are beams and this and this and this these these are beams which connecting the total 12 column columns and coming to the dimensions of the columns this one two three four this four columns having the dimensions of 9 by 18 coming to this series in this line 1 2 3 4 these four columns having the dimensions of 9 by 9 and coming to this north side column 1 2 3 4 these four columns having the dimensions of 9 by 12 why because the center to center distance of the these two columns are 18 feet 8 inches coming to the these two columns center to center distance is 11 feet 4 inches that's why we given the more dimension for this column and less dimension for this column and this column is interconnected to the in between center of the these two columns and coming to the source side in the vertical direction the center to center distance of these two columns is 13 feet 6 inches and between these two columns is 12 feet 4 inches and between these two columns is 12 feet 8 inches coming to the plot area the total plot area is 2000 square feet and plinth area is 12 square feet and slab area is 1535 square feet.